What's up, Mr. Tudor? Let's go over here and see if we can find this lily, this other lily. Come on, Mr. Tudor. Want to come follow me? Huh? What's up? Come on, kitty. I've got a, uh... Yeah, that sure is beautiful. I'm so proud to have that. I think this is my very last raspberry suede of the season. Oh, wait, no. There's a couple more. There's my gorgeous yellow ones back there. Yeah, those are frilly yellow ones. Beautiful things. I'm looking for, um... <coughs> Excuse me. Looking for what I think is a callus lily up in here that I planted. When I planted this thing right here, it was just a little sprig. And now it's growing up into this giant thing. So other stuff I had planted here kind of got overtaken by it. Let's see if I can find a... Like, for instance, there's some fennel. And it's even spreading out. Look at this. There it is. I see it. There it is. Still living. Still cranking down there. In, in all this junk. And I think, I'm not sure, but I think it's yellow. Anyway, I need to... <clears throat> Oops. Look up online where they like to be planted. Where's the optimum place that that kind of lily would like to be planted? Apparently not. It's, it's surviving well back here. So maybe it doesn't like a lot of... And it's been back here for a few years now. And amongst all these weeds. Ugh, yuck. I'm gonna get my ass. These were, that were white, they turned pink like this. This is an oak leaf hydrangea, by the way. And as you can see, this was was pink. This was supposed to be pink. Maybe I gotta, I don't know what I gotta do to make it pink. But it's blue, it's pretty. We're good. I'm not gonna bitch. <laughs> I'm not complaining. And I actually have uh, some of my canis lilies coming on. And I have to keep them in here or the chipmunks go to town. Chipmunk problem here. That's why I don't get to have much in the way of lilies because they eat them. Lilies and roses. That's where I have to keep my roses in in containers. And I gotta get in there and get that cleaned out. And my straight up orange ones are going to town. These pretty things. Now these are perennials. They come back year after year. These have been out here. I think I planted these last year. I bought them when I got the uh, lilies my mom gave me. These things are just gorgeous. And I noticed that the place where I got them from, the people that bought that house up there, the, the, there were some that popped back up and they moved them to a special area off to the side, replanted them, the ones that popped back up. So I might go up there and speak to them one day and just see if maybe they'd like to have some of the peach ones that were there too. You know? These are just really gorgeous. And, and I'd love for them to be, you know, in more one place so people can see them. Like I say, there's a lot of people that like lilies around here. And I might start going around and just seeing if, uh, you know, they might like to, uh, you know, trade off when we go to propagate them if I've got any colors that they like. This one right here is about to bloom again. And uh, I've got another one that's hidden up over behind that, that, that damn tree right there. And it used to be like three inches high. Look at it. Wow, 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 wow. And 
It's the same uh, style of lily, but they're a cream color. Very pretty. Just very pretty. It's gonna last forever, but anyway. Nothing like a garden in the rain. What do you think, Mr. Tudor? Oh no, Mr. Tudor, what are you doing? Oh, kitty. 